Hello and welcome to the Facts Channel. Our channel explores psychology, relationships, marriages, men, women, husbands, wives, sexuality and more. Please subscribe and comment and we will certainly respond. Enjoy the video. The One Brain Revelation, unveiling 12 provocative insights, why men think with their private parts, over logical thinking. Do men really only think with their penis and not their brain? While it's true that some men may act on impulse and make decisions based solely on their sexual desires, this does not mean that all men think with their penises. Here are 12 surprising explanations for why some people might assume that men's singular focus is on the penis, not their brain. Number 1. Brain Structure Studies suggest that men may have slightly larger amygdalae, a part of the brain responsible for emotional processing, than women. However, this difference is not significant enough to explain why men are thought to have only one brain. Additionally, just because someone has a certain physical characteristic does not mean that they will always behave in a particular way. Number 2. Biological Needs Men do have certain biological needs, such as the need for sleep and food. However, these needs are shared by most humans and cannot account for the stereotype that men only have one brain. Number 3. Misunderstanding Neurology Some people believe that men's brains are wired differently than women's, but there is no scientific evidence to support this claim. The differences between male and female brains are subtle and vary widely among individuals. Number 4. Hormonal Differences Testosterone is a hormone associated with masculinity and aggression. While both men and women produce testosterone, men typically have higher levels of it in their bodies. This can make them feel more confident and competitive at times, but it doesn't necessarily mean that they are thinking exclusively with their penises. Number 5. Physical Differences The male reproductive system is located in the pelvis, which makes it easier for men to feel aroused by visual stimuli like breasts or butts. This can lead to the assumption that all men think about is sex. Number 6. Emphasizing physical strength. Throughout history, societies have valued physical strength above all else. This has led to the assumption that men must be strong and dominant in order to be considered real men. Even if a man is intelligent or emotionally mature, his ability to physically dominate others may still be seen as more important. Number 7. Socialization. Boys are often raised differently than girls, encouraging them to be tougher and more competitive. This can create a culture where men feel pressure to act on their impulses without considering the consequences. It is also possible that these social norms are ingrained in men from an early age, leading them to believe that their penises define who they are as individuals. Number 8. Cultural Norms For centuries, society has told men to be aggressive and assertive, while women were expected to be passive and submissive. These gender roles reinforced the idea that men were more animalistic than women and had less control over their impulses. This creates a culture where men feel pressure to act on their impulses without considering the consequences, even if it goes against their own beliefs or values. Number 9. Mythology Many myths and legends portray men as heroic figures who conquer their enemies through brute force. These stories reinforce the idea that men are naturally superior to women and don't require much mental effort to succeed. Number 10. Fear of Rejection Some men may fear rejection by women if they show too much emotional vulnerability. They may try to compensate for this fear by acting tougher and more confident than they really are, which can lead to them making decisions based solely on their penises rather than their brains. Number 11. Sexual Repression Men who feel ashamed about their sexuality or who have been taught to suppress their emotions may struggle to connect their thoughts and actions with their bodies. They may resort to using their penises as a way of expressing themselves since they feel like they cannot express themselves otherwise. Number 12.
personal experience. If someone has had negative experiences with men, such as being harassed or assaulted, they may generalize those experiences to all men. This can lead to feelings of distrust and anger towards an entire gender. If you really find this video informative, please do subscribe and share. Plus, please comment and we will certainly respond. Thank you for watching our video on the Facts Channel.